Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Pokemon Sleep. Let's head in and check out last night's sleep research. Hope you all slept well. Certainly feel rested. Excited to see how the graph shows. <laughs> it matches up. Wonderful. Full 100 sleep score with an extra 30 minutes more. Yeah, a little bit more slumbering battered in there. It's good to see. But snoozing wins out for today. Oh, we're finally in a top valley territory. All right, let's see who showed up. As we're fun to see that we got a top belly. Just now, got still a couple more ranks before we're starting to see a full group. So we got Jigglypuff, <laughs> Jigglypuff top belly. <clears throat> we got Wapafet, Flaffy, Flackaw, Slowpoke, and Mareep. All right, no. Huge surprises there. No ditto. Hanging out stealth. Let's see. Is there anybody hungry? Alright. That makes things easier for me. Because none of them I particularly need to take home. All right, more diamonds. Good. Right. We'll just take the slack off home. <laughs> nice and easy. And that'll do it for this morning. We'll check and see the stats, and hopefully, it's something good. I'm not going to share Jigglypuff candy, because as we know from my candy inventory, most of these are ones we don't really need to share out all that much. So I'm going to share out the uh, Slack off. It would be that or Mareep, but I feel like from Electric Week enough of those have been shared out that maybe Slack off hasn't gotten as much love and attention. We're getting into that last third of 54 to 55. All right, level 13 and sassy. Berry collector, no berry finding S in the level 10 slot. We've got tomato, honey, and apple. So aggregate of things. It's a berry collector, so that's actually not bad to have a nice smattering of different ingredients. And no rank up on skill. Research EXP bonus, skill trigger, skill level up, ingredient finder, and helping speed all the way at the end. I made skill chance up, so maybe this is good. I got a little bit of room, so I can hold on to that for a little bit after I run calculations on it and see how useful it may be. Let the team recover. Some sneaky snacking from the night before. More honey to cook with today. Finally getting almost back to a full bag. You know, it almost took the entire week, but it's been slow and steady. Sleep points. No additional news. No medals. Community. 43, all right. Looking good. And a rank up with a shiny Pupitar. Fancy. And a shiny, another rank up with a shiny real. Very fancy. There's some more linking cords. Might need to use a couple of those. Get them out of my inventory. 
Yeah, no, I'm pretty good for now. Got a little bit of space to work with. Okay. Let us... Gather the resources. Make some tasty breakfast. Not you. You come last. Excellent. Oh, you got some more? Yeah, you do. Mm. No skill trigger for you, though. That's fine, though. I will take a bunch of oil. And make sure that I can make that yummy, yummy popcorn. Alright. And then come Sunday, <clears throat> I can make tea time scones or uh, pop on Deli Bird to make, help get some eggs back to make the Belgian macarons. It'll be nice when those will we have it will have an expanded pot enough that you can make it regularly. Have to really like concentrate on an ingredient team to make that, but that would just be fun to see. I think being able to just make a nice big old it's like sixty ingredient thing every day. All right, ranked up to ultra three. Ultra 2. Getting ahead of myself. Good. Get everyone full energized so they can keep on producing as the day goes on. Alright. So, the next thing to do... They did say it yesterday. I only need 272 more Dream Shards to get this done. So, I feel bad that I gotta do it, but I wanna do it today. I had a feeling that I would get kind of close and it would be actually nice to still have a little bit of a buffer considering I don't know what's going to end up happening next week. I mean if I do have another like used candies I, I suppose there's a couple of evolutions that I could probably do. This one. Number held. I'm just going to use one. But yeah, I would like to have a nice little buffer. We could start building the coffers back up. Just over the line. 228. That completes our candy use for the week. But I do also want to get that done while I'm here. Kind of teased it yesterday. I didn't feel right just saying, I'm going to hold off now. Besides, we don't get evolutions all that often, right? So, fun to enjoy when they show up. So, now we got Toxic Broke. And I'm just going to get that done now. Uh, 
Yep, so evolution's done. Do I have enough? No. <laughs> Alright, so... It, well, at least now it's got more carrying bonus. I forgot that it's got to get to 30 to get that next piece of ingredient. So, got another 5,000 <laughs> dream shards. But at least now it's got a carry limit of 19. So, that extra boosted space is certainly going to make up enough of a deal that um, it's got ingredient finding as part of its nature and as part of its skill set. So, it should be able to... I'm not going to get as many as I will when I'm 30, but at least from here I can let part of it naturally go. So not only will there be some EXP gains just from, and less Dream Shards needing to be used from just naturally letting it get EXP overnight, but in addition, uh, having that increased space means I don't have to keep quite as close an eye on it as I used to. So. I can come back in a little bit and, you know, I can check it more regularly like the rest of them. So now we are significantly better off in the oil department. Because Walrein and Wigglytuff were doing a pretty good job of pulling in some oil. I need Toxicroak now to really step that up. Okay. Now we finally completed that mission. Get some more diamonds. We'll also get some more from just berries and cooking. Not gonna probably be hitting the befriend Pokemon this week, unfortunately. Again, just the things are finally, you know, getting a little bit closer to being a little bit more picky which Pokemon I take home. But looks, looks, things are shaping up pretty good. Still got a little bit of a ways to go. Desserts aren't nearly as strong as the other dishes that I've got. It's just a little bit easier for me to get them. At least to making at least the popcorn. But I think more than anything right now, just getting that island bonus up is what's going to really help consistently get to the master ranks here. Because that's Master Three. It's gonna it's gonna be a fun challenge come Sunday, but with the extra pot space, I have I have good feeling that things will work out. And if not, we'll come back after Entei and just keep at it. But that is what I have for today. Thanks so much for stopping by. Always happy to hear how your week's going down in the comments below, and I'll see you back tomorrow for some more sleep research. But until then, sleep well.